Hi Sagittarius, Narai here, going to do a reading for you guys. This reading is going to be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Narai, I go by May. And so, if you're returning, welcome back. We are going to do a quick reading this morning. Yes, it is going to be quick. And um, please know what fits and leave the rest. It's not always that every reading is going to resonate with you, so if it doesn't, keep in mind. Um, there may be bits and pieces that resonate. Uh, what doesn't is for someone else. There may be whole readings that are for somebody else. So, let's get started. Spirit, what messages do we have for Sagittarius? My North Node. Sagittarius Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Please and thank you. Messages or guidance for Sagittarius. I'm going to need five cards to start my reading. Please and thank you. Five cards to start my reading. Please and thank you. Messages and guidance for Sagittarius. Thank you. Messages and guidance for Saggies. Mm. All right, first is 20, uh, the world. Seven of Pentacles in reverse, Six of Pentacles. Mm. Two more cards, Spirit, please and thank you. Oof. How was that? That was more in reverse, but it was sideways when I I pulled it up out upright, so that's how it needs to be read. Okay. All right, the world. The world card. This is about completion, fulfillment. This is closing out a cycle. This is some sort of fulfillment. Sorry, I'm just like taken aback by the photo. Look at it. See it? It's just very interesting. So I feel like you guys should be, this is also somebody traveling. I feel like you guys are not doing the things that you need to be doing and accomplishing the things that you need to accomplish even though this is upright because seven of pentacles is in reverse seven of pentacles in the upright is like the self-investment card this is a person investing in themselves knowing or investing knowing something's going to be hard work and waiting for a profit things paying off efforts leading to success but it's not and it's like some of you want to be here where you're closing out cycles and you're able to travel and you're fulfilled and, and things are working out in your favor and you're trusting the, the universe, but you're not even working on yourself. How can you trust the universe when you can't trust yourself to do what needs to be done for your progression? And I think some of you are not putting yourselves first and you're not doing the self work, but you're giving to others. You have to do for others what you, you have to do for yourself what you are willing to do for others. You have to do for yourself what you are willing to do for others. And this is actually making sense why the, the, the magician card was more upside down than right side up, but I pulled it out right side up so the six of pentacles is also like someone being taken care of you need to take care of yourself you can't take care of everyone else Sagittarius I swear that last week 
I did a reading. I think it was Sagittarius. Last week I did a reading for Sagittarius telling Sagittarius, Sagittarius can't carry everybody. This is, oh my gosh. Holy shit. I know this is not for me because I don't carry nobody. No one. My boundaries are strong. I'm saying that as a Sagittarius North Node. Because when you put people first and you don't take care of yourself, you suffer. And then you can't take care of the things that need to be taken care of. You guys are not taking care of yourselves and you're preventing your own growth. You're stunting your growth by putting people before yourself and not investing in yourself. Who is investing in you, Sagittarius? Please tell me. I want to know. Have you noticed that you've been investing in other people but not taking the time to invest in yourself? You are so worth it. I'm here to remind you just in case you forgot. Wake up, sleepyhead. It's okay to share the wealth, but don't be used. Don't be taken advantage of. And you know what? It's almost, this is in reverse. You guys are not deciding because this is a tough decision. This is a tough decision. This is somebody able to make a decision. It's like, it's so easy for you to choose to help someone else, but I still feel like it's hard for you to take care of yourself and choose yourself. It's very easy for you guys to help someone else. I think some of you are starting to see that. Oh my God, you are. Some of you are starting to see that. Some of you are starting to see that. I think some of you are starting to see that some people only come around you when they need something. You have the ability to change things you can manifest. This is a person that makes things happen. This is a magician. The magician has all the tools. Holy crap. So for some cycles, they're not actually closed until we focus on ourselves. And I think you're right there, but you just have to be able to say no to people if you're not already. And you can close out a cycle. And then you can concentrate on manifesting other things you want in your life, Sagittarius. Oh shit, this was just what's on the top. Yeah. Page of Cups. I feel like you guys are helping people that really don't have anything to offer. Like they're not really doing anything for you is what I mean. And if you have a need to help people all the time or to be needed, that might be something from childhood that needs to be addressed. And I only say that because this says inner child. Um, but also with the magician card, when you start manifesting, take care of the inner child. Do things that are fun and exciting for yourself. Well, that was quick. I think this is like a continuation of last week's reading and I cannot believe that this came out but you guys are you guys are taking care of people before taking care of yourselves you have to take care of number one numero uno por favor that's you Saggy. all right Sagittarius that's what I have for you please like share and subscribe love you guys bye